A couple years ago, Jose and I survived a very rickety zombie apocalypse in State of Decay. We played it on the Xbox 360. Well, 2015 is the year of putting out old games, sure. uprising them a little bit. Yeah. So why not do it for that game too? This is State of Decay Year One Survival Edition. I call it the Jose Edition. The Jose. Yeah. Okay. It's weird, but you can call it that. Sure. It's a lot of abbreviation. This is available for your Xbox One. And what it is essentially the same State of Decay that you played before, but you've got a little bit of extra DLC in there. And you've got what they say, 1080p Win! sweet ass visuals. Jose, are they are they lying to us? Or are they? Are yeah, they, are they right? I mean, the visuals do look better. I mean, I went and took a look at it again on the 360, and then I played it on the Xbox One. And okay, there is some differences. Congratulations, you guys made this game look a little bit better. But there's still some of the same issues that I had with the original playthrough of the game, like the control sometimes when you're in the middle of these battles that I just found still broken. Dude, help now! It's really upsetting because what they've done is essentially kind of glossed over the game. They've made the models a little shinier. bit better. Everything's a little shinier. You don't get quite as much tearing with seams and stuff. So it looks a little bit cleaner, but it still doesn't look very good. This was never a great looking video game. I still dig the core ideas of State of Decay, and you're right, it's about community building, it's about surviving a zombie apocalypse in kind of a realistic way. You've gotta get supplies, you've gotta like protect your little fortification, you gotta figure out, are you gonna grow your own food? Are you gonna you know, get medicine to people? People start freaking out, like your little gang starts having breakdowns, oh, you gotta deal with that. The SSDF. Yeah, yeah it for sure. sure. It sure does, and it's really cool watching that happen. It feels a lot more Dawn of the Dead than Dead Rising. You're not gonna go into a group of zombies and like, put a chainsaw on a broom and wipe them all out. <laughs> Like you, Which would have made this it game. It kind of would have because the combat in this game is, is a bit of a problem. It was a problem before, and unfortunately, it's still a problem now. Now, quick question I have for you. At the beginning of the game, when you're starting, it'll ask you if you want to upload your save from your Xbox 360 version. Could you do that? Uh, I did I not. I tried. It wouldn't let me. Yeah, I didn't actually try it. I, I wanted to start this game. This game I was like, fresh. this is great. I like this. is going to be cool. I don't have to start all the way over from the beginning. I can bring over my save from the Xbox 360. I don't know how the hell it would have known yeah. because my Xbox 360, I don't believe, saved in the cloud. It was on my console, and so I, I was kind of sad I don't really that. understand how that was supposed to work. Is there something I missed? Yeah. Was there something in the manual of this downloadable game that I didn't get? I don't know. I don't know how that works. I didn't want to do it. I started from scratch. I wanted to see this game from the very beginning, clean. I, my, my survivors were also mostly all dead. I started over and just tried to kind of build up my community again and wanted to get back into like that gameplay loop, which I still think is good in State of Decay, which is like building your crew of survivors, going out and foraging for stuff, and all the cars in the game, you know, if, if, you, if they blow up, they're gone forever. I love the permanence of everything in this world. It's really interesting. It's got a lot of cool ideas, and it is fun. It's just rickety and a little broken, and I don't understand why in two years they haven't been able to patch all that up. They could have just patched all that up, not fixed the graphics at all, and re-released it, and it would have been better than fixing the graphics yeah. and having all the broken code. Well, I think now they're getting ready for the next iteration of State of Decay. That's not the original game that's just two years old and remastered. I think they're going to hopefully be delivering us some brand new undead goodness, maybe with uh, the country of Decay, Well, hopefully, not just the state. Hopefully it won't be decaying anymore. I'm tired of this game decaying as I'm playing it. I want it to be in better shape. Even though it's cool, I still had fun playing it. I just didn't have as much fun as I would hope out of a big HD remaster. And for that reason, I'm giving it exactly the score I gave the 360 version, a 7 out of 10. I'm giving the Yose Edition a 6.5. Yose would do that. <laughs>